Hello everybody! This video will show you one of the fastest way to make yearly over $3000. This consists in solving one of the treasures map in the game that is really easy to take and it will use near 30 minutes to solve with this guide. So back to the topic northwest from the strawberry and on the west from the Omwania lake you will find a point of interest called the obelisk that you can find upside a small cliff. Once you inspected the point of interest, you have to get close to the obelisk and search for its plaque that hide the first map with the gold earring item. This map represents a tiny church. This one can be found not far from St. Denis, so take a taxi coach if you want to take the treasure fast. Once here, you need to go slightly to the north from the city, northeast from the y on the in the map. Here, not far from the road, in the forest, you will find a tiny church, that you can inspect. Action will unlock the point of interest and will lead Arthur to draw it in his diary. You also can enter it by crouching. I think it's too cute inside, isn't it? Anyway, to get the next map you need to climb the building and behind the bell tower you will find the next map with a silver A-ring. The next point of interest to discover is Mysterious Hill home that is situated northeast from the Baku station. If you want to use fast travel, go to Valentine, that is the closest you can get with the taxi coach from your next destination. Enough close, not far from the road, you can find a house similar to the Hobbit's one. Just inspect it in order to lock the point of interest. Now, from behind, you will be able to climb near the upper window that hides the next map with a gold jointed bracelet. The next map represents the Boulder Glade point of interest that is situated inside a Civil War battlefield. This one is located to the east from Rhodes, so it's better to take the train or taxi coach to save a lot of time. Once here, find a small rock cliff in the middle of the battlefield, with a broken tree in the middle. Upside here, you will be able to inspect the interest point, while for the next map is located inside the tree hole. The next map represents a clock upside a mountain. This one represents the mysterious old style clock upside the mountain shine located northwest from Strawberry. 
Again, you need to use the taxi coach to get to this last city. Once enough close to the right location on the top of the mountain, you will see a dark smaller rock upside the mountain peak that is the location of the treasure. The map indicates two arrows close one to another and one of them look like hidden. In fact, on the clock you will see two arrows, one is yellow and the other is orange. Upside the orange arrow you can notice a boulder that from the color seems different than the mine structure. Interact with it and you will gain the 6 gold bar for a value of $3000 and $15 in cash. Now it's time to exchange the gold with the cash. To do so just go to any fence vendor and sell the gold bars.